Hi, I will show you today how to make your own uh, DSD files uh, directly from your analog gear. So I have here um, the main board of uh, Sony PSHX 500, which is a um, uh, no normal analogic uh, pickup and uh, it also can uh, transform the analog uh, signal in uh, DSD files or PCM. <coughs> you can choose. Um, I uh, have now uh, this new board which you have to to buy from uh, maybe a service uh, authorized service uh, Sony. Um, the main um, the main board contains um, the analog section here. This is the phono preamp, and uh, this switch is for internal or external uh, uh, signal. We will not use this uh, section for our um, purpose. Uh, in this uh, case, we will try to to make a separation between um, the analog and the um, analog to digital converter, which is this this chip. This is the main processor. And this is the power supply, 5 volts USB. So, uh, as you can see in the diagram, um, we can uh, clearly uh, the, uh, cut this, this part, even physically. Uh, also, we will have to to gain access to these two capacitors which are uh, the entering uh, capa capacitors for the analog to digital conversion uh, section. So in fact to, to obtain a DSD um, capture board we have only to unsolder these two capacitors and uh, to attach a cable, a stereo cable, which uh, will connect this uh, analog uh, input to your uh, analog source, whatever tape recorder or uh, maybe a phono preamp, maybe a, a better phono preamp than this one. So um, let's do this. The it's very easy to separate. In fact, it's um, quite uh, easy. Only these two capacitors have to be unsoldered from the. <coughs> from the board and uh, now the job is almost done because uh, they put some uh, some glue here so you can uh, you can hear that they put some glue on this uh, wire, ground wire. <coughs> so basically, the job is done. We have here these two capacitors. We have the ground connection here. We just have to 
put a cable and uh, we have the our uh, DSD uh, converter. Okay, to save time, I will show you my old uh, module. I have two of them. Uh, I uh, already put here, as you can see, the, the, the cable. Uh, it's an... Uh, um, good quality cable from uh, SL1200 uh, series Technics pickup very low capacity and uh, good quality so I attach this uh, this cable observe that uh, I cut the the phono preamp because I don't need this. I uh, made some separation for uh, the motor control section which I don't uh, use. So I try to minimize the consumption uh, so that um, uh, I can um, use the USB uh, connector from uh, any PC to um, to power this uh, this board, I attach also uh, some additional uh, power uh, connectors so that uh, I can uh, power it uh, from any source available. Uh, so the USB is the original one. It's uh, the connection for uh, for the PC. But I also attach it an, um, an uh, micro USB so that uh, I can um, I can power it from uh, from any PC um, any any PC which have uh, additional uh, USB port. Uh, in fact, uh, this with a battery powered uh, PC can be an uh, uh, independent uh, um, converter for uh, DSD files. N uh, I, I uh, in fact, I use this uh, converter uh, without uh, any mains supply because I uh, noticed that uh, the sound is uh, the better quality then uh, when it it, uh, it is uh, uh, put into the main socket so uh, I, I use mainly on batteries I will show you we will uh, use the Mac because it's smaller and uh, I will make the, the connection right now so here is the power 
and here is the USB. Let's connect them both to the Mac. And um, now we can uh, start the application, which is Hi-Res Audio Recorder. It's downloadable from the Sony site. And um, we'll have to first go to File. Uh, settings settings and uh, to confirm that piece HX500 it's uh, seen correctly by uh, by the computer We can choose the um, type of uh, file, DS DSD, which uh, the extension is TSF, or PCM. In this case, we can uh, we can choose the sampling frequency from 44 to 192. But we will use the DSD because I like DSD. DSD can be 2.8 or 5.6. Once um, these settings are OK, we can hit the rec and they put Start recording. So now we have the DSD file. We'll, uh, okay. When it's uh, complete, we hit recording complete. Maybe it's better with the light. We hit recording complete. We can, um, uh, if if the the level is not uh, quite uh, enough, big enough, we can choose auto. Uh, in this case, auto will increase with uh, 6 decibels. So uh, you can choose if you leave it like that or with 0 decibels or you can, you can uh, choose uh, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 or auto on, in this case with six decibels. Okay, they inform you that uh, increasing the gain will result in longer time in writing to files. If you accept this, you hit OK. Uh, they already increased uh, the level. And um, now we have write to files. In this case will be file 1, doesn't matter, uh, album artist, so on, and uh, write to files, and that's all. Now we have uh, the option to, to, to write to files, okay, this is uh, just an um, just an example and uh, uh, that's all.
thing. In fact, uh, I don't want to, to save this. But um, as you can see, it's very easy to convert your uh, precious uh, uh, records or uh, tapes by using uh, maybe 100 uh, euro uh, mainboard from from a commercial product. Okay, from this point we can um, we can go further and uh, um, uh, find that uh, maybe the power supply is not so good, so we can improve the the power supply. We can uh, put um, analog. Um, this is a switching power supply on this board, but we can use an. Um, let's say linear analog uh, power supply uh, with classical transformer and um, uh, uh, bigger capacitors and uh, so on uh, at least for the, um, the analog uh, part of the, um, the converter so the AD converter uh, consists in a analog part of this some Half of this is uh, the analog part. With uh, we can also uh, change the uh, integrate the operational uh, uh, amplifiers. Uh, we can uh, change a lot to improve the quality of conversion. But as a basis, I uh, I use this for two or three years. And uh, I am very happy with the DSD files I obtained like that, without without doing nothing, uh, nothing at all. But for this, the second uh, the second board, I I will try to to improve the quality of the components, the quality of uh, the power supply, and I will show you when uh, will be ready. I will show you maybe will be balanced I don't know uh, let's uh, let's take it step by step so thank you very much I uh, hope you enjoy this and uh, good luck in find this uh, board and uh, to to have a lot of DSD files uh, obtained made by you in the house thank you mm -hmm.